Hello and welcome. Today's lesson is a question from one of my regular students here on YouTube about two common adverbs in English. Here is his question. Hello from Brazil. Teacher, could you please explain to us when and how to use as well and to in English? And here is my answer. Yes, I am happy to talk about the tense as well and to. And I am also happy to talk about the word also. All three as well, to, and also are adverbs, meaning in addition. They are used in similar ways. Please keep watching to learn the rules and usage when using one of these. We are starting and we are starting right now. So when to use as well, to, and also in English. To is the most informal, but it is often the best choice when speaking American English. As well is a little more formal than to, and it is less common in American spoken English. Many Americans do use it in writing, however. Also, it's generally more common in writing than in speech. Please keep watching to learn how to use each of them correctly with examples. How to use as well, too, and also in English. To and as well usually come at the end of sentences to mean in addition. Let's listen to a short exchange. John is going to Bangkok. I am going to Bangkok too. The speaker could use as well, although it sounds somewhat formal. The speaker could also say, I am going to Bangkok as well. You see that both to and as well are used or usually come at the end of sentences to mean in addition, right? I am going to Bangkok too, or I am going to Bangkok as well. The word also can appear many places in a sentence or clause. Here are a few. At the start of a sentence, it can be used to present a new subject. Let's see the example below. We are so excited. Also, we brought a surprise. In this sentence, you can simply see that the word also is being used at the start of a sentence. It is used to present a new subject, we, right? We are so excited. Also, we brought a surprise. But more often, also appears in other positions, such as before the main verb. Let's see the example below. We are so excited. We also brought a surprise. In this sentence, you can clearly see that we are using the word also before the main verb brought, right? We are so excited. We also brought a surprise. When be is the main verb also comes after be, as in, I am also really excited, not I am really also excited, right? And lastly, you should note that none of these adverbs as well, too, and also are used in negative statement. Instead, use the word neither or either, as in the examples below. I can't go to Bangkok this year. You could say, that's sad, neither can I, or I can't either. So what we are simply saying is these adverbs have no negative forms, right? Instead, you should use the word neither or either. For a lesson on this topic, be sure to check this lesson over here where I covered either and neither in English. Thanks for watching. I hope you found some value and learned something. If you did, I'm happy. Please show me some love by hitting that subscribe button and bell icon so you don't miss out on my weekly interactive English lessons, just like this one. This channel is all free, so it means you can copy this link and share with a friend on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, WhatsApp, or whatever forum you are. That will be helping this channel to grow in order to keep bringing you interactive English lessons just like this one to help boost your fluency, confidence, and speaking skills. I will see you around soon.